so it's June 10th, 2020, and I'm here at the uh, Ferncroft Trailhead. I'm going to be doing Whiteface and Passaconaway today. No idea if that's how you pronounce it or not, but anyways. I uh, spent last night at the Waterville Campground. I had an enjoyable evening. Uh, nice, uh, nice and quiet. Uh, no problems at all. So anyways, today's looking fairly decent weather-wise. It's probably going to be partly cloudy, but hopefully we'll have some decent views along the way. And anyways, we're going to start our hike. So just starting up the Dicey Mill Trail. I had to do a little road walk. I mean, it wasn't wasn't far at all. I don't even know if it was an eighth of a mile, but but along there is a couple beautiful old houses. I would have liked to have filmed them, but uh, I did snap one quick picture, but there was vehicles in the driveway. Nice little walk through the woods. You can hear the stream in the background and so forth. A few mosquitoes out, but nothing, nothing too bad. And of course, I've got some spray with me if I need it. pretty decent time. I was surprised. I'm here at the intersection where uh, continue on with the uh, Dicey's Mill Trail and head to Mount Pesa, Pesa Conaway. I don't know if I pronounced that right or not again, but or head over to Mount Whiteface uh, first. Uh, I think I'm going to go up to Pesa Conaway first, turn around, come back. Uh, I was thinking originally about doing blueberry ledges uh, going up, but I guess I missed that trail already. And I don't think I want to go down that. Uh, from what I hear, it's pretty pretty steep, and I'm not sure how well marked it is or anything like that. Uh, I mean, I haven't seen any blazes or anything on the trees so far, and not that that's an issue. I mean, the trail's very well worn, so. Certainly can't get lost on on this, but I'm just wondering on those ledges if uh, if it's obvious where you need to go up and down those. So, anyways, I think what I'm going to do is go over, like I say, to Pescaway first, come back, go to Mount Whiteface, and then most likely just turn around, come back the way I went in, uh, instead of attempting those ledges. Uh, I'd rather play it safe. I think it adds a couple miles to my trip, but that's fine. I don't. I don't mind that, so it's nice out, nice little hike. Uh, these trails have been beautiful so far, so anyways, I think that's what I'm going to do. Somebody lost their hat there. Uh, coming back, maybe I'll grab it and put it in the lost and found uh, down at the trailhead. Anyways, uh, we'll continue on. to the summit and now this is more like the trails I'm used to <laughs> climbing the 4,000 footers back home in Maine rocky and fairly steep fairly close to the summit now and got this whole rock I'm standing on fairly nice views at the moment still a little tree covered but at least it's opening up a little bit the clouds aren't too bad So, maybe 
made it to a tree covered summit and uh, now that we've tagged this uh, we'll start heading back might just wander down the trail a little bit further just see if we catch any more views uh, but otherwise we'll turn around head back and go to uh, Mount uh, Whiteface next so I went just a little bit further beyond the uh, summit and uh, came to this view a little rock pretty nice this totally mangled, moss-covered forest. This obviously gets hammered year-round. Pretty cool, actually. I like the moss. It's pretty cool to walk through the through the woods. These trees help. This mangled. So as you can see, we made it to the, uh, actually I guess technically it wasn't the summit, the summit's tree covered, but made it to the ledges up on uh, White Face Mountain and took a few pictures up there and a couple videos. Headed back to the uh, vehicle now and uh, basically going back the way we came, uh, decided not to go down blueberry ledges. The people I was talking to were saying that it was uh, pretty steep and it's not bad going up but going down I guess could be a little tricky so missed the opportunity uh, coming up those on this trip but uh, maybe back sometime in the future okay I think technically this is the official summit of the of uh, Mount Whiteface you can see there used to be some rocks piled up here but it looks like they got knocked over you can see them kind of scattered down through the woods there now they're certainly you know, there's a few over there too. Um, so I think this is officially, it. at least that's what my GPS is saying. Uh, but I like my other <laughs> summit better on the ledges. But in either case, we uh, hit it uh, no matter where the official summit is. We uh, walk past it. So anyways, we're going to continue on down the trail. So almost back to the car. Uh, had a great day today. Awesome trails. Uh, decent weather. A little cloudy a couple times, but uh, rain held off. So that was great. And uh, so we've got some nice views. And uh, going downhill now on the Daisy's Mill Trail. Fairly smooth. I really like this trail. Uh, but anyways, should be back to the car shortly and I'll head home. Uh, about a three and a half hour drive, but it uh, won't be too bad. But somewhere along there, a uh, hamburger and fries and milkshake is in order. But uh, anyways, thanks for following along and uh, we'll see you on the next one.